Am I the asshole? For telling my best friend his GF is disgusting? I have been friends with Danny since high school and he recently moved in with his current GF Lucy. They had a housewarming party on Friday and Lucy spent most of the night dancing with her own friends who are very like her excitable extroverted EG in dragging Danny away from his conversations with us his friends to dance even though he's more like us introverted not party animals. Later Danny was being quiet so I asked if he was okay and he said just tired, but he just kept watching Lucy dancing and then said something in her ear the next time she came over and she just shook her head and laughed at him. After she went back to her friends I asked if it was bothering him how she was behaving and he asked me to explain. I mentioned the attention seeking dancing and the fact she was wearing something really revealing even though other guys were at this party. Danny said it didn't bother him then sat with a moody face. At the end of the night Lucy sat down with us and started chatting non-stop about how amazing the party had been. I pointed out jokingly Danny obviously wasn't enjoying himself since he looked miserable, and Danny told her I was worried he was jealous because of her outfit. Lucy ruffled his hair which he hates and said he was quiet because he loved her outfit so much he couldn't wait for us all to leave so he could drag her to bed. I thought that was completely inappropriate and said to Danny in that case I'd leave if she was just going to be disgusting and Lucy just laughed at me so I did leave. Today Danny has messaged me saying Lucy wants an apology before I'm allowed back at their home but when I asked if Lucy will apologize for making me uncomfortable he said no she doesn't have anything to be sorry about. I was genuinely only worried about my friend but admit I could have just left without calling her disgusting so am I the asshole? ETA to clarify I didn't say the comment about her clothes directly to Lucy, I asked Danny once then never mentioned it again. I asked him because I know in the past he's said anything overly sexual makes him uncomfortable. He's not the kind of guy who makes innuendos or anything. Also I'm in no way jealous of Lucy, she's the opposite of how I'd want to be which is fine people can be who they want and Danny and I already tried dating years ago but the spark wasn't there and it was uncomfortable after we tried being intimate and we both agreed we were better as completely platonic friends. You're the asshole and a jealous one at that. Edit to add Danny was uncomfortable because of the way you were acting. You're the asshole. I'm sorry but that's such a hateful way to talk ABT someone's GF just for having fun. She was literally just minding her business having a good time you had to hate on her for it. You're the asshole. Your friend literally told you that he wasn't bothered but you still felt offended it's giving jealous and felt compelled to say something despite both of them being fine with it. And if he wasn't fine with it, it still wasn't your business because if he wanted you to know he would have told you. You didn't jokingly point it out, you said it because you wanted how you felt to be known. Yeah you're the asshole. Lucy sounds like she was having a good time and Danny didn't seem to mind her behavior at all until you decided to stir up drama. I don't know if you feel like you're losing your friend or if you have a thing for him but you've injected yourself into his relationship unwanted and unasked and insulted your friend's partner. Apologize and stop being so judgmental of their relationship if you want to remain friends. You're the asshole just say that you wanna date Danny and be done with the jealously. You're the asshole. You sound jealous lol. You're the asshole. It's his relationship, not yours. Just because something is bothering you doesn't mean it's bothering him. Commenting on whether he was okay with her wardrobe makes you look controlling because it is. Unless he expresses something directly to you, it's not your business. You're the asshole for sure. What throws me off is how you say he hates having his hair ruffled. Why tf would you bring that up like that? That's his girl. You sound jealous of the relationship honestly. Everything you said points to jealousy. I think you need to step back and asses your feelings before interacting with them again. You're the asshole it doesn't sound like anything Lucy did bothered Danny at all, it bothered you. What would Lucy apologize to you for? For enjoying her housewarming party with her partner? You sound jealous not necessarily of their relationship, 
but possibly of Danny now having someone that he's as close with, or closer to, than you. My husband is an extrovert. I'm an introvert. We've been married ten years. He sings karaoke. I just sit at the bar with my crochet, he chats with everyone. I don't. She was just dancing and having fun. And you slut shamed her with that outfit comment. You didn't ask he was uncomfortable being dragged onto the dance floor. You made it all about Lucy and her behavior. But who I think, BTW he was uncomfortable because of you. You shamed his GF for nothing. But who and are you in love with him or something, it's giving pick me. You're the asshole. It's not your place to sit and judge Lucy on her personality or her clothing choices. Especially to her BF, who chose her. Are you sure you don't think you and Danny would be a better fit, and you're jealous? You're the asshole is this worry, or jealousy? You're the asshole. Very jealous and envious behavior. You went into Lucy's house and tried to pin someone you call your friend against his girlfriend who was doing nothing wrong and just enjoying the party. Sounds like you were being very dramatic and it upset both of them. Now you are doubling down. Utter and you sound jealous. And misogynistic. Women can wear whatever they want even if gasp other men are around. Couples throwing a house party expect each other to interact with the other's friends. Sex is not disgusting. She didn't go into detail she just didn't let you slut shame her. You're the asshole. Seems like a whole lot of none of your business. You're the asshole. You are at a party and describe dancing as attention seeking. You judge other women for what they are wearing. You speak on behalf of a grown man instead of allowing him to speak for himself. Uck. You're the asshole. Danny wasn't at all bothered by her actions. You shouldn't be offended on his behalf. The only people who know what their relationship dynamic is like are the people in the relationship. You owe her an apology. You're the asshole. You were bothered by how she dressed and acted, not your friend. Seems like she was enjoying the party. You're the asshole. The only one who shows any disgusting behavior here is you. You're the asshole. It looks like you are jealous and try to pick on her for no reason. You're the asshole and read about internalized misogyny and how to conquer it since you're practicing it religiously. Info do you think a woman enjoying herself is a crime greater than murder? You're the asshole. You're the asshole you sound exhausting. The only thing that's disgusting in this story is your misogyny. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. How long have you been in love with Danny? You're the asshole if he doesn't like it, it's on him to talk to her or break up with her. It's not really your place to say what she should or shouldn't she said or did is inherently wrong. You and your friend might not be into it, but the hostility is uncalled for. You're the asshole. Sounds like you have a crush on Danny. Your behavior at the party was completely out of line and judgmental. Lucy has got nothing to apologize to you for, but you do. If I were in either Danny's or Lucy's position, I wouldn't let you back in my close circle unless you both sincerely apologize and totally change your attitude and behavior. But, uh, why are you so worried about her clothes and her dancing? You sound obsessed and jealous. Jesus Christ. Go clutch your pearls in the privacy of your own home. You're the asshole. I didn't catch you were female until I went back to look. But for some reason I knew you're jealous. You very much seem to have a crush on him. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Mind your own business and stop hating on other women. He's with her for a reason, he loves her and is building a future with her. I'm sure you're not like other girls but it's time to get over yourself. He doesn't want to be with you. You're the asshole it's not your place to tell her what she can and cannot wear, and it's not your place to judge either of them for what they do in their own time. It's not like they were describing what they were going to do. Super judgmental of you. You're the asshole. Stay out of other people's business. Sounds like Lucy was just having fun and you had to make it awkward. You made it uncomfortable, not her. 
You're the arsehole you were offended by Lucy's comment? The description of your behavior makes you sound jealous more than anything. And a bit immature. You're the asshole. Keep this behavior up and you're not going to have Danny as your friend for much longer. If you have feelings for your friend, you need to deal with it and move on. You're the asshole. The jealousy has been covered already so I'll focus on your instigation. You planted why he needs to be upset in his mind then continued to assert that in your opinion he should be upset then you say it's her fault he wasn't having a good time? Then you decide to take it upon yourself to instigate a fight between them by telling her how he feels and when that fails you tried to instigate a walkout which failed. You're lying to yourself if you think you're not jealous, unless you can give a reasonable answer as to why you are so eager for them to fight. You're the asshole. Sounds like she was just having a fun time and you're uptight about everything. I don't see anything disgusting about what she said, that's pretty typical joking around at parties between couples, so I don't know what the issue is. You would absolutely hate the parties I go to lol. You're the asshole wasn't your place to say anything, so I recommend staying out of your friend's relationship. You're the asshole. You were judging her all night. It's pretty obvious that you are super jealous. Stay out of your friend's relationship. You're the asshole. You're jealous and you think you know this guy so well that you can speak for him. You are losing him to his GF and his life and you're scared. Perhaps you don't understand other women because you should know we don't wear certain clothes or enjoy dancing to turn anyone else on. We do it for ourselves. Sounds like you wanted to ruin the party and cause trouble. You're the asshole. What on earth would make you think you have a single ounce of authority over this woman's behavior or choice of clothing? What would make you say something like that to anyone, let alone someone your friend obviously cares about deeply? You owe her an apology and you owe yourself some self-reflection about why you're being this judgmental about someone else's GF. You're the asshole, you sound obsessed and jealous. So how long have you had a thing for Danny? You're the asshole. Utter girls that hate other girls are scary. You're the asshole. Why do you care what someone else wears? Why do you care that she danced with her friends? Why do you feel the need to judge her personality or her relationship or comments she makes to her boyfriend? Sounds like you dislike everything about your best friend's girlfriend and you're trying to make them both feel bad about their relationship. Leave them alone. You owe her a massive apology and should stay away from them until you can get over yourself. You're the arsehole and have some wicked incel vibes. Seek therapy for your jealousy and misogyny. You're the asshole. You sound like a jealous teenager. Lucy was having fun. You are the opposite of fun. You need to apologize to Lucy and keep your mean girl comments to yourself. You're the asshole. He doesn't want you, get over it. You're the asshole, massively. You're the asshole they are leaving together in their early twenties for Christ's sake what you think they do at night? Play Scrabble? Good for them to be young and carefree and in love apologize none of your business, rude and antiquate. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. I saw you comment and say that you don't like Danny romantically and just want him to be happy. Well unless Danny tells you himself out of his own mouth that he isn't happy, you can't project your own dislike for Lucy onto him. He's clearly understanding of how extroverted Lucy is, it seems like it's just you who doesn't like it. You were being mean to her and trying to create an issue that didn't even exist in her home. You're the asshole and it seems like you're making trouble where there is none. If he's not happy with something he can talk to her. It's not up to you to suggest she's making him miserable. Maybe I was just tired from the move, maybe he's tired of your speculation. You acted like a jerk. You're the asshole. Just admit you wish you were in Lucy's position with Danny. Get over him or tell him how you feel. You're the asshole. It doesn't sound as if she did anything wrong. He's an introvert. Being quiet is in his nature. It doesn't mean he's having a shit time. 
This post reeks of jealousy and pick me attitude. You're the asshole. Jealousy. It shows. Obviously he likes her enough the life together and you think you know her better than him? You know his feelings more than him? Get confidence and you won't feel the need to attack the girl who seems to be magnetic and happy. Also it's very high schoolish to be jealous over who he talks to and hold that against him when you obviously had a let's separate ourselves attitude. Did you stop watching either of them the whole night and just have fun?